Judge.me Shopify Tutorial for Beginners Hello and welcome to our channel WebWiz. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can use Judge.me in Shopify. So please watch till the end to properly understand the tutorial. So the first thing that you need to do is open your browser and kindly go to Shopify.com or you can simply click the link on the description below and you will be directed on this page in which it will show you the details about this platform. And if you don't know Shopify, it is an e-commerce platform that provides businesses and individuals with the tools and services needed to create and run their own online stores, in which it is known for its user-friendly interface, extensive customization options, and a wide range of features designed to help users set up and manage their e-commerce websites. And now, to access this platform, they also offer a variety of pricing plan that you can avail by simply clicking the pricing option on the top panel you will be able to see here below, some of the plan including basic plan, Shopify, and advanced plan. And you will see here below the corresponding prices on each plan and also the list of benefits it included. However, to start free trial, just click the start free trial button on the top right corner. And after signing in, you will be directed on this home page of Shopify. And from here, it will show you on the left side panel some of the options that you could also navigate, such as home, orders, products, customers, and any other option. And now, the first thing that we need to do is to add a products. And as you can see, I already have a three products, but if you want to add more, just click add product on the top right corner button and you will be directed on this page in which from here, all you need to do is to fill out all of the required information, such as the title of this product. And after that below is the description of it. And after entering the description, you could also import here a media files from your computer, or you could also upload a videos and 3D models. And also below here, you could also enter the pricing, which is the price of it and the compare at price. And also below, you also need to enter the cost per item, and you will be able to see your profit margin. And aside from that, if you scroll down below here, you will also see here other details, and you could also customize here the weight of this product, and even add the variance if you like. And after that, to save the changes, just click the save button on the top right corner. And upon clicking on it, you will be directed on this page, in which from here, it will show you that the product has now been added. And if you go to your online store by simply clicking the eye icon beside this online store right here, you will be able to be directed on the next page, in which from here, you will see some of the product below here. And by simply clicking on any of the product, you will see here some of the details, including the picture of the product, the size of it, the description, and even the prices of it. And as you can see below here, it has no field of feedback or reviews that the customers can also input in here. And in order to do that, we're going to use the application that is called judge.me. So to do that, just proceed by clicking add apps and under the recommendation, it will show you the judge.me product reviews in which it has a 5.0 star. And to proceed, just click the install button and upon clicking on it, you will be directed on this page. And from here, just proceed by clicking install up button right here. And after clicking on it, you will be directed on this page. And as you can see, you have now successfully installed the application called judge.me. And below here, just proceed by clicking start setup button. And after that, the next thing that you need to do is to simply click this button enable app embed, which app embed is required for reviews to show properly in later steps. And after clicking on it, you will be directed on this page. And as you can see, we're currently on the editing section of our online store. And on the left side panel, under the app embeds, the judge.me are now turned on. Now going back to this page right here, after enabling app embed, just click the next step button below. Then for the next step, which is to install the review widget so that you can start collecting and displaying reviews immediately. And by clicking on the button Install Review Widget, you will be directed on the next page in which all you need to do is to wait for it to load. But since it is now too long to respond, we can now go back to this page and move to the next step and just skip this part. 
And as you can see in here, they couldn't find the review widget block. So that means we'll not be able to complete the step-by-step -step process in order to see the review in our online store. So just click skip step below here and you will be directed on the step 3 which is to install the preview budge. And by simply clicking on it, you will be able to be directed in here. And unfortunately, it says here that there's a problem loading this page. So that means there's a technical problem with Shopify that has prevented this page from loading. So you can reload this page. And after reloading, you will be directed in here, in which as you can see, we're currently on the editing website section of our online store. And from here, you will see on the left side panel that the preview badge of dodge.me are now set up. However, you will see here below on the right side panel that there is no reviews or feedback available for the customer. And that is because we skipped the step two that are too long to load. But if you wait on it patiently, and if it is working, you will be able to see here below or the footer section, the feedback field that the customers could also provide their feedback and reviews. But currently, it is not available on my page. Now going back to this page, to proceed, just click the finish button below here. And upon clicking on it, it will show you a pop-up window it says here that we couldn't find the preview badge block, which is also the reason why we can't find the field of feedback and reviews. And now to check it again one more time under the online store, just click the themes and below here, just proceed by clicking this customize button right here. And upon clicking on it, you will be directed on this page in which from here it will show you some of the editing tools that you can use to customize your website. And as you can see under the app embeds, the judge that me has now been turned on. And to view our website, just click this view button right here and you will be directed on this page in which from here, you will see some of the catalog or the products that we just sell. And by simply clicking on any of the product, it will show you some of the description, the prices. However, there is no feedback field and reviews since we will not be able to finish the three steps. But if you do finish those steps, you will be able to see here the feedback field that the customers can input to provide their insights and also their feedback. Now going back to this page right here, under the apps, you will see the judge.me reviews dashboard in which you can manage the reviews by clicking this import and export button right here, you'll be able to import videos by yourself by simply uploading a CSV file. However, from here, you can no longer add your own reviews in here, but you can manage reviews, collect reviews, widgets, marketing and social, and also navigate the general settings, which is also important in order to track the performance of the sale of your product and you will be able to see the reviews from other customers under the Manage Reviews option. But you also need to remember that you must finish the three steps of Judge.me reviews in order for the reviews and feedback field to be added to your online store. So that is just how you can use Judge.me in Shopify. Thank you.